So today I have something super special and I'm so excited to do. This is Laura, the Charm of Faded Hues. If it looks a little familiar to you, I'll tell you now, you're correct. It is the black and white version of the Laura Floral. So in honor, I actually have my 200% Laura Tulip right here from the same series. And I did not even realize that she's also the cover, but in black and white, so I just thought that was perfect. So let me just bring Laura 200% up here so we can take a closer look. This is the tulip one. Now in the regular version with the 100% um, like the regular size one, she's not orange, she's actually pink, but the 200% is orange and yellow and I really love this it's just it stands out a little bit more so this is our 200 percent laura right here and she's gonna be in the background while we unbox the rest of the black and white laura floral which is called the charm of faded hues so this is what the box looks like i really like how it looks when i first saw this i thought this is like the chanel version of laura just because the black and white is so pretty the artwork is so nice this is the same uh, tulip one back there. Uh, this is the front. Like I said, they're all going to be black and white, so uh, it's just so pretty all together. And I do own the floral version, like the regular one, so I am just so, so excited. So let's go ahead and get to unboxing. So this series really, really I'm so excited about. I just saw it offhand and I was like, I have to have it. So I'm so surprised they actually made a black and white version. Um, it's just, oh, I'm so excited. Let's see which this first one is. I can't really tell by the colors because they're all black and white. But this one is, oh, so pretty. This one is Rippling Flirtations. As always, all the Lauras does have the stand and it does say what series they're from. This one's kind of hard to read because the writing is really, really tiny. There you go, but this one is called Laura Faded Hues and Shante. I think yeah, that's yeah, that's what it says. It says Faded Hues and Shante. So all of them will have the stand. I'm not gonna show for every single one, but you'll see them kind of standing on the stand. So a closer look at our rippling flirtations, Laura. This is so pretty. And I noticed, I don't know if all of them are gonna be like this, but it has that same ceramic quality as the Skull Panda warmth where it looks all ceramic because this is a lot shinier than the regular version. So this is, oh, it's just so pretty. Like, oh my gosh, I don't even have words for it. It just looks so chic. So this is Rippling Flirtations and this is our card. Okay, so I thought of instead of explaining what, because I was struggling for a little bit trying to explain what the colored version of this one looked like, I'm just going to go ahead and show y'all. So this is from the Faded Hues version and this is the colored version of the same one from Laura Floral. As you can see, oh, it's so pretty. Like I love the, Laura Floral was one of my favorite um, series of Laura. And I have to say, like, seeing it in black and white makes me love the black and white so much more. It just looks so chic. And do you see what I mean by this one is the regular type of material. And then this one, I know, like, it's so shiny, but it has that ceramic look to it. So we'll find out if all of them have the ceramic look. But, oh my gosh, it's just so gorgeous. I love it so much. On to box number two. Oh my gosh, I hope it helps you guys that um, I'm showing the colored versions of it just because I feel like it just gives like mo more of a, like, a look to it. And you can see why the black and white one is just so chic. All right, so this one. Ooh, so cute. This one is the Whispering Iris. So let me go ahead and compare. All right, so let's take a quick look at Whispering Iris. As always, Laura has the stars in her eyes. This one, her eyes are blue, which is really cute. Um, this one has signatures everywhere. Like, I feel like they put the Laura signature on all of them, kind of like how on this one it's on the hat. That's so cute. So this is what she looks like. Her original Laura floral version looks like this. 
So fitting that it's purple since it's an iris. So that's really, really cute. So this is what they look like side by side. Ooh, there's a tattoo missing on this one. So pretty. There we go. And this is our card for Whispering Iris. Up next, number three. Okay, let's see what this one has. There's our stand, and this one is, ta-da, this is River Serenade. So this is River Serenade, as you can see. It's really hard to come up with something to describe them because it, I just don't want to repeat myself and be like, this is black and white, <laughs> but this is the design. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. It has that like, it kind of almost looks like Yzma from Emperor's New Groove. Anyways, <laughs> it looks like um, just the color is just so cute right there. So this is what she looks like. This is her card. So we can see the card for River Serenade. And let's go ahead and take a look at her comparison from the floral series. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Yeah, it looks like all of these from the Faded Hues collection is going to be of that ceramic type of um, material, which is honestly, it just adds to making it look more bougie. <laughs> it's just so chic. So this is kind of what they look like a little bit more up close. Uh, I can't decide between... I'm just glad I have both, okay? I love the colorful ones, but I also love the black and white. So this is what River Serenade looks like. I'm gonna have to apologize to you guys to see like it takes me a while to name them because they all look so similar in colorway so I'm looking at the cheat sheet for what they all have but they kind of look similar in the beginning so this one ooh, okay oh this one's so pretty this one is called Sylvan Blooms so this is what she looks like this one i love the most so far it's so chic look at her shoes it's so adorable the flower here in black and white is just so amazing oh what's that on your face oh it's like a little makeup tattoo thing that's cute the straight black hair oh my gosh the hat the hat is it has a signature so uh, it just adds more to that like very um bougie touch if you know <laughs> like everything just looks so adorable so this is our sylvan bloom and this is our card and this is gonna be our colored version so she's blue in the original with black with white stockings or shoes uh blonde hair but oh my gosh it's just giving such high-end look even the regular floral version looks very high-end but in black and white it's just oh i love it okay so on to number five that's going by way too fast i think i can't believe we're already on number five all righty so this one is oops this is the stand and we have Ooh, this skirt is so pretty Okay, this one is called Unopened Petals. So this is what she looks like. She has this super cute white outfit. The socks on her shoes are just so cute. It has that like flower scalloped uh, kind of look to them. Uh, her hair is so pretty. She has that uh, headband that has Laura on it. Oh, the pigtails with like pearl scrunchies. So pretty. Oh my gosh, I love it so cute so this is our unopened petals and this is our card for it and now let's take a look at the colored version wow such a big contrast in color love both of them i really can't decide between the two i just feel like one is more the fun version and then the other one is just really the chic version so so cute so I do have all the regular versions. I didn't get a secret on the Laura Floral original set. So I'm hoping that I do get no secrets here. Otherwise, I feel like I'd be searching for the random regular design that I don't have. So yeah, hoping for all regulars. Ooh, 
Ooh, this is the one with the pointy hat. I always forget her name, but this one is called Nature Brush Strokes. So this is Nature's Brush Strokes. Her outfit is just so cute. It's like a jumpsuit, and I like this paint splatter. It almost kind of looks like a really cute design there. And I always remember her as the pointy hat girl in the floral one. <laughs> She's so cute, though. This is so chic. And then this is our card for Nature Brush Strokes. Now we have our color version. Oh, in the color version, she looks sad. This one, she doesn't look sad. She just looks, I feel like in this uh, black and white version, all of them just kind of have this like neutral expression. Oh, they're so, so cute. It's so funny to me, like looking at the designs and like acting like, oh my God, which one is this? Because I've seen the designs, they're just in black and white, but I don't know, I feel like you have to be a collector to like appreciate the little color changes like that. Ooh, okay, so this one is our little Clustered Serenity. So this is an up close look at Clustered Serenity. On the colorful one, the colorful version, I've always thought of her as like a 1920s flapper, like Great Gatsby era. And this one in black and white just solidifies it. She just looks like she just straight walked out of that novel or movie, whichever one you prefer. So this is our figure for Clustered Serenity. She's very pretty with the polka dots. And this is our card. Now let's take a look at the colored version. See what I mean? She looks, she reminds me of like a flapper on this one, but on this one, it's just, it kind of just seals the deal. Just very flapper-like. Super, super cute. I'm so glad they revamped this one. All right, I feel like we're moving way too fast. I think we're already on number eight. That's like way, way too fast. Ooh, let's see. Oh, I don't want this card. Please don't show me. There we go. Okay, this one is... Ooh, this is Misty Strings. So this is very high fashion look to me misty strings just has that like it girl vibe to her love her outfit it's almost like a drapey dress Ooh, oh okay look at that <laughs> so she's wearing underwear but just the drapey dress so her shoes boots thigh high boots are like textured that's so pretty oh my gosh i love it i've always thought even in the original version that she was very high fashion so this is our figure for misty strings and this is our card now are you guys ready for the colorful version oh so so cute i love the colorway of the colorful version um if you're new you guys already know i love yellow if you guys aren't new i mean i already love yellow and pink and this is just really the prettiest colorway to me same texture on the boots just in black and white it's so so pretty they both have their little underwear there oh my gosh i love them so much this is just gorgeous so we just have four left now so i left the last three and then our box right here oh, just so we can kind of keep track of where we're at but i'm so sad that it's only down to these i just oh they're just so so pretty and i just want to keep unboxing more and more so let's see which one this one is stand Ooh, this one is called faint trays and the colorful version is actually my favorite from the original so i can't wait to show you guys all right so a closer look on faint trays she's very cute kind of it girl looking as well um with a little silver crown she's just so adorable um so this is what our figure looks like and this is our card now are you guys ready because the colorful version is my favorite from the original series and this is what she looks like. I just love this colorway. She just, oh, the details on the hair. I mean, those details are still on this one, but they're just in black. So I don't know if you guys can see like those hair details. Yeah, they're just in black on this one. So this is what they look like side by side. I will have to say that Faint Trace is not my favorite from the Faded Hues collection, but 
She's very chic looking. Love her. Okay, down to the last three. For sure, for sure. Let me just move this here. There we go. Down to the last three. All right. Wouldn't it be something if we unbox the tulip one last? Just because, like, I have the big tulip right there. The cover is the big tulip. I don't know. It doesn't ever happen that way, though. If I planned it, maybe it would have, but... So this one is called The Fragrant Trail. So this is our fragrant trail. She has flowers on her dress. Oh, you can you see the details of like daisies drawn on into her hair? That's so, so cute. So this is what she looks like. Oh, I always thought that she was like the creative one in the group from the original series. This is her figure and this is the card for fragrant trail. Now let's take a look at her colorful version. See, doesn't she look like she would be like the creative one of the group, like the free spirit? She looks so cute. I love seeing them side by side. It's just two different, like it's giving two different vibes, but like, oh my gosh, it's just, I don't know. I just really like it. Okay, two left. Let's go ahead and open the second to the last one. Okay, there we go. Ooh, looks like a special card. Look black, so it looks like a special card. Let's open this one. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is the secret. You guys, this is the secret from this set. Oh my gosh, this one is called Mirrored Twins. I cannot, <laughs> look, I am happy to get a secret, but this tells me that I'm now going to have to be on the hunt for a regular design. So I'm kind of like, oh my God, and I, now I need the secret from the original set too. Oh my gosh, I am <laughs> excited and like, oh my gosh. So this is Mirrored Twins. You can see that she has a little bit more color. Everybody has been like more black and white. But as you can tell, her eyes have color, her eyeshadow has color, the flower on her hat has color. Like this one has definitely has more color than the other ones. I love the hat on this one. The details are so neat. Her outfit is so, so cute. <laughs> this is so crazy. I can't believe I got the secret on this set. So this is our figure, the secret, and this is called Mirrored Twins. And this is our card. I really thought we were just going to get a special card when I saw the black card, but nope, it's a secret. And I just wanted to point out that the secret is not ceramic like the rest of them. Like, let me show you guys, because um, I don't have the regular uh, secret to show you guys, but you see how this is like a ceramic look. Meanwhile, the secret is very matte compared to the rest of the series, which is that ceramic look. Oh my gosh, this is such a pretty secret. I cannot believe it. I am so excited. Okay, now this leaves us with this last box, which I am hoping is the tulip, which is called Snowy White on this one. But since we know things don't always go my way, this is probably gonna be the other one called the Withered Shadow. So let's see, I don't, oh, that one came out all at once. Let's see what we get. I um I can probably feel it by the shape. Oh yeah, this is this is not the tulip. <laughs> now I'm gonna have to look for the tulip. Oh my gosh, I cannot. <laughs> yep, this is withered shadow. Okay, we we don't hate withered shadow. It's just I was excited. I have the 200% tulip, but it's okay. It's okay. So this is our Withered Shadow. She looks so cute. Like the clear um, or transparent black skirt is so cute. The Chinese style um, dress is adorable. Oh my gosh. So she is very, very cute. Okay, like I'm not disappointed. I'm just kind of laughing at the irony that I got ready with the tulip and we did not unbox the tulip. But this is our figure and this is our card.
And now for the colorful original version, here we go. This is what they look like. They both have the clear skirts, except for this one, it's more pink. Uh, and this one, it's of course black because it's black and white. Very, very cute. So, so adorable. Okay, so as much as it would have been cool to see the tulip unboxed, I just want to show you guys this is the 200% tulip and this is the 100% colorful tulip. Let me show her a little bit up close. So she's pink like I told you guys earlier rather than orange. She's so pretty. Um, the black and white version is like almost like in a wedding gown because it's like an all white dress, all white hat. Um, but at least we have our 200 and our 100% Laura to look at. So I want to show you guys a quick look at the Laura floral version, the original colorful one. So this is what they look like all together. And now let's take a look at the faded hues versions. So this is our Laura black and white or otherwise called charm of faded hues, the black and white version of Laura floral. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, tell me, which one do you guys prefer, the colorful version or the black and white? I feel like I can't decide between the two just because this gives me like intense Chanel vibes and then the other one is just so playful. So let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys have a good one.